Welcome to Jari Caribbean, a place where we give you the very best in Caribbean food, travel, and lifestyle every week. Please like and subscribe to our channel for more content on exquisite Caribbean cuisine and recipes, plus highlights of the vast variety of interesting Caribbean travel destinations and cultures. Click the notification bell to receive future posts. Watch this video to the end for a special bonus. This week, we're going to explore the secrets to Jamaica's athletic success at the Summer Olympic Games. Have you ever wondered, why do Jamaican athletes run so fast? Jamaicans are known for their speed and athleticism, dominating sprint events at international meets. With a reputation as a laid-back, reggae-loving food nation, it has long been a mystery as to how they are so fast on the track. Today, we will explore some of the secrets behind Jamaica's quick success and take a closer look at some of the best-known Jamaican athletes like Usain Bolt, the fastest human of all time, Shelly and Fraser Price, who is one of the most decorated Olympians, and Elaine thompson era, the Jamaican sensation of the 2020-2021 Summer Games who completed the double-double in both 100 and 200 meters in Rio and Tokyo. These are only a small fraction of the Jamaican athletes who have made their mark on the world stage. Because Jamaican track and field superstars, success goes back many decades. Jamaicans are known for their speed and athleticism, dominating sprint events in the world track and field competitions. Some people think that this is because they were born with fast twitch muscles or good training methods. But there's actually something else going on here too. Athletics in Jamaica is seen as a ticket into celebrity status and fame. So, Many youngsters grow up with Olympic dreams and work very hard every day to hone their skills in professions such as running. The Jamaican government is also firmly behind the success of developing athletes, providing financial and technical support to national team members. But you might be wondering why these Caribbean islanders run so fast. It turns out that the ingredients for their success are a combination of good genes, hard work, but also some delicious food. What makes them so special? There is one gene that has been labeled as the speed gene that has been identified by scientists as the reason why Jamaican sprinters run so fast. It also affects athletes from West Africa. It is said that this particular GDF8 gene made their leg muscles twitch faster than other people's legs would when they have to sprint across a finish line. And it accounts for up to 10% of their speed advantage over others in competition. But that's not the only thing when looking at this anomaly. It is just a scientific, but also harkens back to the horrors of the past. In recent history, when 10 million Africans were removed from their motherland of Africa in the atrocities of slave trade, more than 1 million of them died in the Middle Passage on the way to the Caribbean. Jamaica was the last stop of this voyage. So, the brave souls that survived that voyage and survived that far were the toughest of the toughest and some of the most determined of all. So, out of an ugly history, rises a nation of warriors who, from the core of their genetics, have come up with natural abilities that far outweigh average athletes. To put it into perspective, this twitch gene, as it is sometimes referred to, helps muscles to generate strong repetitive contractions which are perfect for sprinting. Now, while only 70% of U.S. international standard athletes have this gene, 75% of all Jamaicans have this variant, whether they're athletes or not. What's the diet of a Jamaican athlete? 
Jamaica's dominance in the world of sprinting is said to be due, at least partially, to an interesting hypothesis. There are a number of biochemical, anatomical reasons for this idea, but Professor Earl Morrison from the University of Technology revealed that two staple crops, yams and green bananas, could have something to do with it. And it's not just the crops that may help, but the nutrient-rich soil of Jamaica too. The humble yam produces hyposteroids, which act as stimulants, while the green banana can produce phytase replenishing energy supplies within our body by boosting metabolism levels. Dr. Morrison explained that during the running of races on a world level, there are likely many athletes with similar speed levels. But they all feed differently when it comes to different stages in their competition due to their stamina. Jamaican runners have an advantage over the countries because of how quickly they can replenish themselves from eating green bananas which give them more endurance than others. Dr. Morrison says, by 60 meters, they start to feed. And it's because we have an advantage of replenishing the phosphate that is allowing us to keep that momentum to the end of the race. The Jamaican Speed This ties in quite nicely to what we have seen in the massive 9.58 seconds 100 meter world record that Usain Bolt achieved at the 2009 World Athletic Championships in Berlin, Germany on the 16th of August 2009. However, this isn't the norm for this Jamaican athlete. A more customary meal would include Jamaican dumplings, yam, boiled green banana, rice and peas with some good old-fashioned jerk chicken. Until July 31st, 2021, at the 2020 Tokyo Olympic Games, where Elaine Thompson era ran the race of the generation to break Americans Griffith Joyner, Flojo's 33-year-old 100-meter Olympic record to become the fastest woman alive. Elaine Thompson era has a bachelor's degree in food service management and culinary arts, and her favorite dishes are yellow yam, the vegetable that Bolt had previously attributed as one of the key components of Jamaica's sprinting achievements and is a staple in her kitchen, plus the favorite jerk chicken and rice and peas. The Jamaican national dish, Akian saltfish, is a regular dish of athletes and many Jamaicans. While her doting grandmother makes soursop juice, refreshing pineapple, berry and citrus drink. And of course, the banana is grown right at home. Thompson Hira has earned three gold medals at both 100, the 200 and the 4x100 relay at the 2020 Tokyo Games held in 2021 to add to her two gold medals and one silver from the 2016 Olympic Games in Rio de Janeiro to accomplish the historic double-double. That 100-meter race also resulted in another historic clean sweep for Jamaican Elaine coming in first, followed by Shelley and Fraser Price with silver and Sherika Jackson bringing in the Bronx to give Jamaica 1-2-3. Out of 206 countries and 11,000 athletes competing in the 2020 Tokyo Olympic Games, Jamaica, a small nation of just only 2.97 million people, finished number 21st place with 9 total medals, 4 goals, 1 silver, and 4 bronze. The verdict. So, if I go eat a plate of yams, I go be instantly faster, leaner, and meaner, like my Jamaican counterparts? No, definitely not. The Jamaican's diet is, is only part of the story. Genetics, a world-class infrastructure supporting the athletes from a young age and a national fire to be the best all make of reasons as to why Jamaicans are so successful on the track. However, if you've ever tasted Jamaican cuisine, you will know that any excuse to sample is good enough. So, the next time I have to do 
anything remotely athletic, you will find me indulging in a large bowl of green banana porridge and claiming it as training. Have any delicious recipes for green bananas or yams you would like to share? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell to our channel to be notified of our future postings of a wide variety of rich Caribbean content on food, travel, lifestyle, and culture. Visit jiry.com by clicking the link to subscribe to our blog where you will receive our weekly Caribbean recipes.